Hello my friends, welcome back to your vintage beauties. My name is Yana and we continue going through an enormous box of jewelry that I got from my local Goodwill. Here's another baggie. This is first look. If you like anything in this video, <clears throat> excuse me, please email me at yourvintagebeauties at gmail.com with the timestamp of the items you'd like to purchase and a brief description. So without further ado, let's pull some out of this box. Oh my goodness, what is this? And let's see what we'll find. Okay, first I have this brooch. A rhinestones American flag beautiful I already have a tiny um, tiny baggy kind of like a lot with a lot of patriotic brooches and earrings so I'll add this one to that what is this oh wow that's a glass and like what pewter I think someone made it kind of a pendant has a little bit of iridescent coating on the glass do you think someone made this that's pretty cool right here we have a ring I think this ring is a uh, silver tone let's see it's not magnetic oh no no this um, does have a pink scratch so this one is just silver tone moving right along oh, let's take a look what's in this baggie I like baggies in the baggies. Oh, this one's in the baggie because it has it multi-stranded and yeah, it would get all messy. Okay, so we have. <clears throat> I do believe this necklace made of colored seeds. I think I had like a red one like this. So we have a necklace, uh, kind of a pool closure. Then it comes to V, and then um, there is um, a pendant with kind of a tassel looking thing. I kind of like it. Yeah, I kind of like it. And it's a very uh, <clears throat> turquoise color blue, greenish blue. Pretty neat. Well, I'll put it back in the bag. I don't want it to tangle with anything else. All right, let's see. Right here I have a single earring. Just gonna put it aside. Couple more single earring. This one I have a feeling is a silver. Let's take a look. Yeah, right here on the ear wire it says 925. Hopefully we have another one. I don't remember having like this in my single earring bucket. Putting it aside. Here is one more single earring with a green um, sea glass. Wait a minute, one more single earring. Silver tone earring on the kind of golden ear wire. I'm not <clears throat> sure this one is original ear wire. see something okay this one's magnetic all right so i'm gonna put it in a single earring pile and we'll go from there um i do believe i have one of these um in my single earring pile i'll i'll take a look later oh and i think i think i have that one too like this one i think i have also let me bring my um 
let me bring my single earrings pile over here okay here it is i have quite few already single earrings so let's take a look There's a lot. There's a lot of earrings. So. Uh, maybe we'll take a look afterwards and see. Yeah, let's do it after the video. Okay, what is this? Oh, this is something interesting. Do you think this one is an earring? Do you think this one is a single earring? Not quite sure. I think the ear wire is kind of thick and kind of short. Not quite sure. Let me guys know. Maybe it is. But um, still, this one's only one. Oh, this is so pretty. Oh my God, guys. I think this one is Labradorite. So we have a gold tone lobster claw memory wire or a kind of a, like an, an illusion i would say illusion necklace and i do believe the stones right here are labradorite you see them you see how pretty they are let's see on the neck It needs to be uh, straightened out, kind of let it hang uh, uh, freely for it to straighten out a little bit, but the Labradorite stones are really cool. Look at them. Like teardrop, teardrops, they're really beautiful. Okay. I probably should put it separately because I don't want it to tangle on anything. This one seems to be a bracelet and it seems to be 95. First of all, the, oh my goodness. Yeah, the lobster claw, this one is um, indicative of 95. And I do believe it says right here, 95. Yeah, I think it's right here, 95. Yes. Then it is right here, 95. And then on the other side, also 95. Very simple bracelet. The design is very simple. Very beautiful awesome right here we have another bracelet this one just has a, a simple hook not sure if i can hook it let me see not too bad very simple bracelet wow and i see something else is uh, right here 925 let me see Let me see if we have, oh, it's just a chain. Hopefully I didn't take the pendant while I was pulling. So right here, I just have a chain and I think it's, let's see, I think it's nine to five. Yeah, it's nine to five. Um, I'll, I'll keep it just in case will find the pendant and also sometimes I have a lot of pendants without a chain so I can put them in my box uh, by the way I have one box available a five pound box for fifty dollars including shipping I have silver in there a few pieces of silver it might be the silver over me and all the jewelry is wearable that I put in there so let me know I have one box 
Okay, this one putting aside. Uh, right here, what is this? Okay, it's not just the chain, but it seems like it's broken right here. Let's see if there are any signatures or stamps. I wouldn't think so. Oh, something's here, I think. Is it just... What does it say, guys? Stir something. I think it says sterling. Yeah, I think it says sterling. However, it's a little bit of, it's broken, even if it says sterling. Yeah, even if it says sterling, it's broken because the other side is uh, tore off. So I'm just going to put it in, in my um, scrap. Okay. Uh, right here we have a necklace, a little bit of a bib style with plastic teardrops, beads, and uh, crystals. However, um, I think it's a bit of worn in the back right here. The gold tone wore off and it's become completely copper. I'm most likely going to put this bib style necklace, even though it's pretty, um, to craft so i just wanted you to see and if you want to guys pull it out of craft just let me know okay a stretchy bracelet uh, most likely that's natural material but uh, that's just colored stone most likely highlights Right here is another bracelet. Oh. Just a pull bracelet, I think, yes. And right here we have um, like a ceramic or stone ceramic, I think. And it's uh, glazed. Oh, I think this one is another, another silver. Um, so that's a bit of vintage. We have um, barrel clasp. I don't see any stamps, but I uh, kind of believe this one is silver and it does have turquoise chips right here. I wonder If it's glows, um, not sure my nails do though. Oh my goodness, really orange. I don't think so. I'm gonna have to test this necklace. Okay. Uh, right here seems something uh, another net uh, silver item. I I assume because of the. Um, Oh, and this one. Oh my goodness, what's happening with this? Um, because of this closure. Oh my goodness, this baggie just keeps on giving. Yeah, I think right here it says 9 to 5. Right here as usual. Uh, right here says Italy. Right here it has nine to five. So this is a chain, silver chain, and the pendants are just um, a plain rectangle and um, a lily flower. Um, I think lily flower. Water lily flower? Yeah, water lily flower. Oh, and there is a letter A in the back. 
it's either on the back or we can put it lily flower this way and you can make it an up front here we go like this let's see if it works let's see if it works yeah i think eventually you can make it um up front or in the back i don't know so but there is a, a small letter a on this side okay another silver item right here i have a i have an earring oh it seems like another silver chain oh my goodness right here i have a single earring let's see oh putting it in the single earring pile for now let me take a look right here i have another silver chain most likely yeah right here is another silver chain 95 right there also gonna put it aside for now just to see if there are any pendants floating by themselves oh here it is that's what it was for i was pulling and pulling and pulling i think this chain's too long for it let's just take a look at this one yeah i think this one fits better the first one that we found there we go here we go i think yeah i think this one looks much better so we have a silver chain and right here we have a a pendant oh that's very interesting let's let me see closer there is some stamps right here i'm not quite sure oh it says ss sterling silver probably not quite sure i'm wondering what this is probably a um, cz but i'm gonna turn presidium on and we can take a look okay i'll put it here aside wow we just started with this one it's already full of silver uh, right here i have an earring and i do believe and this one might be silver mm, it's actually actually a little bit of magnetic but i put it in a single earring pile here is another single earring pile in the sea. Oh, I found a pair for this one. So now we have two. We have maids for their sea glass dangle earrings. All right, free presidium is up and running. Let's see what we have here. Yeah, this one's just a simple glass. Yes, this one's just glass. Interesting. Great beginning of the lot. Oh my. Just found this. This one's probably from this one. Huh? What do you think? Let's put it on this one. But it's kind of too long. I think it's kind of too long for this. The chain is very long, guys. Very, very long. So what do we have here? Not quite sure this one is silver, though. Yeah, I think it doesn't belong on this one. Let's see if the stones are anything. No, stones aren't even glass. I don't even... The small ones are... Might be, yeah, small ones are glass and the big ones are not. 
so the big one is not glass and small ones are glass and this one's a bit magnetic but it's a cute pendant okay right here i have a very interesting necklace this are a kind of a silky cords and we have faceted uh, ab coated beads it's too stranded but it's long and i think you can um, put it twice around your neck um, i mean two strands are layered very cute very cute all right let's move right along right here is another single earring put it till later right here i want to know what this is this seems like that's interesting okay let's take a look is this 95 italy or something else 585 italy oh my god this is gold guys this is not silver this is gold and it says gi do you guys know what gi is okay what do we have here right here we have kind of um hammered links oh wow i am i am speechless to be honest right here also says 585 italy on the other side and also says i am i am speechless we just started we just started we keep on finding silver after silver now i found gold this this is the, a bracelet and i think this one is like eight and a half inches wow let's see yeah these are i think hammer not yeah i am i am and it's pretty heavy 585 585 is it like um 14 carat let me know guys let's see let's take a look how many grams this is is it zero okay eleven grams I think it says eleven grams let's see eleven point thirty seven nothing needs to be touching it let's let's see this negative 15 my goodness okay let's turn it off turn it back on let's see how many grams this chain i mean um 11 grams 11.42 grams that's pretty heavy that's a solid one that bracelet is a solid one that's that's an awesome find this is a pretty awesome find straighten you up guys a little bit okay wow that's amazing okay moving right along i don't know if we can top this one off today right here we have a it looks like an earring but what happened here what oh okay so right here we have an earring uh, i wonder if someone made it interesting earring oh magnetic all right putting it in a single earring 
Uh, right here we have a hematite stretchy bracelet with a cross with the cross and icons I think or maybe saints yeah saints right here different saints okay this one I do believe this one is a belt let me take everything out it's pretty hefty and it's all over the place yes this is a belt i don't know how i'm going to show it to you but okay it's two stranded chains they have a kind of a flower or a circle in the middle decorative very decorative at the end it just has this hanging this kind of pretty hefty ball and um, it does have a hook so you can hook it at any point what is this i don't know what this is it fell off of something not the i think it's a broken um earring i think it's a broken sir uh, not circle uh, <clears throat> small hope earring yeah so i'm just gonna put it in my scrap scrap okay so let's see if you would wear this i think you would just hook it like this and this one would just hang i guess this one's pretty hefty ball pretty decorative huh what do you think i don't know what it's made of let's take a look Oh no, my goodness, no. Okay. Here we go. Belt. Okay. A single earring. This is brass colored necklace with a crucifix there is no um closure i think it's just over the head um, brassy color brass necklace and a crucifix a pin brooch silver tone while i have pressy on let's take a look glass rhinestone oh, oh i need to close it let's see is it closing i don't understand what's happening I don't think it's closing. I think it's broken. Yeah, I think it's broken. I'm just going to put it in um, most likely in a uh, craft lot. Let's stick. Don't pay attention to this one. Only to this one. This is kind of pink. It was previous previous scratch. take a look no this is not silver yeah this is not silver okie dokie now i feel way more confident in testing silver so this brooch is going to craft lot because i can't close it this is an earring this is very interesting because I don't know what it's made of. Kind of like rubbery texture. This one kind of leathery texture. But again, just one. 
uh, one more single earring, uh, kind of a filamiori beads and a howlite, a howlite elephant. Also just one. A strong feeling that this is silver, the ear wire. Still only one. Oh, did I find another one like this? Yay! We have a mate and they both have the same uh, ear hoops, ear wires, I mean, so this one's a pretty cute. We have a pair. I have a single earring like this. Then I see one like this. Uh, this one I do definitely have. I remember. It's probably going to be easy to find. Yes. Here we go. I find two. We've found a mate. This one I'm going to put as a single one. I do have this one 100%. I remember this one. Let's see what it says on the back. Monet probably or something like that. Yeah, Monet. Yeah, we'll do it at the end. Okay, I think this one another silver, guys. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I hope it is. I hope it is. Look at this one. Yeah, I think so. Oh, let's see. 95 Italy. Right here, 95 Italy. This one another chunker. This one is a uh, flat silver tone chain. Pretty long. Pretty long. This is amazing. Look at this. So much silver and gold. What is this? Don't tell me this one is <laughs> gold. Oh, that would be fun. No, I don't know what this is. <laughs> This is probably not. Um, anyway, uh, it's broken regardless because uh, there is no, there is no um, closure. <laughs> yeah, this one's magnetic. I can put a closure on this one. All I need, um, jump hoop, um, jump ring. Why am I saying jump hoop? Jump ring is here, but oh, right here I need to attach um, maybe lobster claw. I have it so I can make a nice chain. Gold tone chain. Um, a single gold tone hoop. Pretty big. Probably two and a half, three inches. Um, a single earring for later. Here we have a button. Hmm. If anyone wants a button, let me know. Beautiful decorative button. A single XO earring, post earring. Oh, there's something says. Uh, excuse the. It's kind of dirty, but what is it? Oh my God! It says 95, 95 ND. Oh wow. So it's vermeil and silver. Oh, I don't believe that one. It's kind of magnetic. I don't believe it. I'm going to have to test this. This one I don't believe is 925 to be honest. I don't. So, but I will test it. But I, I have only one right now. Another single earring. This one is beautiful. Uh, this one is Berry Bay. And oh my goodness, this is a different Berry Bay earring. Hmm. This one's pretty cool. I like this one. Really like this one. Bit magnetic. Hopefully we'll find another one. Ooh, what do we have here? Agate. This is an artisan piece. Um, this is a pendant agate in in um, a frame. Oh, it's a little bit like comes out from this one, but okay. Interesting. Oh my goodness! I think there's another silver chain right here. Huh. 
What do you guys think after that class? Silver or not silver? I think it is. It turns red. Let's double check. Here we go. Brown. Brown and red. Very red right here. So I think it is silver. This one is silver. So this agate is in the silver um, frame. Go. Here's, here's your red. So much silver. I cannot believe. Let's take a look at this bracelet. Yep. I think this one is another silver one. Oh, that's what it is. Buying at Goodwill. Untested jewelry lots. 95 95 oh my god my fingers are getting so dirty and grimy and like i don't like that bracelet silver bracelet i am i am in awe okay we got another earring we got a a friend where is that earring we got a friend for this one. I am not sure if anyone made it or it was like this, but we have uh, a pair. They're pretty cute earrings, dangle earrings on the wire, your wire. Okay, what is this? Oh, this is very interesting lock. I like this one, safety lock. Older kind of... Um, how do you open it? Oh, I'm so confused. Hold on, like this? There is something has to do with this button, I think. Oh, right, like this, okay. I figured it out. Let's see what it says right here. One twentieth, uh, twelve karat gold field, and some kind of stamp, probably company stamp. But I don't, I'm not sure. I oh, I've seen it somewhere. Is not like em Emerson. I think this one um, is Emerson. I'm not sure. I will need to double check. So this one is twelve. This one is a bracelet box, box closure with a safety latch. And it says 12 karat gold field. And I think it's Emerson bracelet. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. Um, one more single earring with the cute rhinestones, colorful rhinestones. Uh, one more single earring with a kind of a dichroic glass, glass heart. I need another one. One more single earring. I don't have this earrings. This these ones are a completely new batch of single earrings. I don't know what this is. What is it supposed to be? Okay. A bracelet. Let's take a look what these stones are. Oh, these ones are aqua, guys. Yeah, these stones are aqua. They go straight to aqua. This is a bracelet with the button closure. And the button closure, I think, is... Oh, no, I thought it was like a bell, but no, it's not. Cute bracelet. All right. One more bracelet. Oh, um, leather and brass. Like this. And it is a hook closure. Let's see if I'll be able to close it on my own. Here we go. I closed it. Really beautiful bracelet. Really beautiful. I would say seven for sure. Wow, really cute. I like the details and carvings. 
awesome bracelet one more pull bracelet a string and a glass blue heart uh, right here what is this I'm not sure if it's supposed to be like this this is a, a pen how is it so that's weird yeah, it's a tack pen, but I'm not sure how it's supposed to work. Yeah, here is the tack pen, gold tone, silver tone, um, lightning bulbs. What did I say? Lightning bulbs? Lightning bolts. I am tired today. What else? Oh my god, we just scratched the surface, guys. We just scratched the surface. Look, I, and we found gold, silver, silver, gold. Here we go. This one I do have, and I think I wanted to find this one. Where is it? It's somewhere here. Here it is. Here it is. We have a pair. I do believe these are silver. Well, they might be silver, might be alpaca, but they're not marked as silver. So I will test. you know what unfortunately I don't believe they are I don't believe they are let me take a look let me scrape it I think they might be no they are not guys they are not and let's let's try with the silver solution Look, with the silver solution, they go bright blue. Bright blue. Let me try again with my... I'm going to try again. With my proper... Silver solution. No, they are, hmm, oh, no, 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 they are, they are, they are, guys, oh, I didn't scratch enough, oh, my goodness, yes, they are silver, right here, we have a pink, okay, all right, I feel much better now, let me collect all of it, yeah, they are right here. I just didn't scratch one enough. Right here is the red. Whew, okay. I didn't want it to happen again that they scratch blue and then not red, you know. But they are not mar marked. I don't believe. Yeah, I don't believe they're marked. Let me take a look if this is a stone yes it is it goes straight in the middle of uh chrysophorus emerald nephrite so i will need to refer to my book and see which one this one is but i will show you closer you guys so you can take a look at the stone and let me know what this might be they go uh, uh, right in the middle of chrysophorus nephrite and emerald um Okay. right here I have another 
pair of earrings and this one say LC I think they're Liz Claiborne they are pretty grimy and dirty and I do believe some coating is off so if you guys want them let me know but the way they are they yeah the way they are I don't like them yeah the way they are they most likely gonna go to um to uh craft because they are really really um right here in the back I don't like how they are scratched all right let's keep going uh, here's another earring I do have one of these this is silver earring I do have one of those in my bucket put it aside right here I have a um, this is just a pendant I'm not sure if I have a chain for this with poor enamel blue poor enamel and a brassy color stretchy bracelet faceted plastic beads Copper colored bangle bracelet, very simple. Oh, I think I think we have a Brighton, guys. Oh my goodness, we have a Brighton right here. We have. Do we have a Brighton? We have a lookalike. Um, I will call it lookalike. There is no B. I there is no B. Uh, we do have a heart closure we do have a hang tag but there is no B and I want to test it for silver okay where is my scratchy let's test this Okay, what else? Let's test um, chain. And we're gonna test a lockety lock. All right, let's see. This one is a lock. This one is a chain. And this is one of the beads. What do you guys think? Do we see red or we don't? Oh, no, we don't. Oh, I don't think we do. It might be silver plated, but no oh this one is uh, no none of it has red not even close yeah no this is not silver this necklace is not silver but it's cute it's a quality of brighton i can tell you that if they wanted to imitate brighton they did a good job so yeah right here might be plated though really cute oh let's see one thing this one is real pearl this one is real pearl the bead is um goes to quartz Um, kind of um, iolite maybe natural beads and these ones are natural real pearls I can tell you that let me show you really quickly natural natural and this are natural pearls pretty cool necklace I really like it though you can feel the quality oh oh my god let's guys pause for a second because I'm getting overly excited. We found so many cool stuff. I like this necklace, even though it's not silver. This one is amazing. This one is 11.42 grams of 
585 gold bunch of silver bunch of um, silver earrings and stuff okay so let's take a look if we found any earrings so we found these ones right i don't have this one i don't think we have this one this one i should have we found a pair of this ones okay we found a pair of this ones i'm looking for this and these i don't think i have this i know i don't have this i might have this one I know I don't have this one. Okay. So, so we found a pair of this. We found a pair of this. Okay, two pairs of earrings. We found a pair of these earrings. This one a polymer clay. Now let's take a look if we find any other. So these earrings for now, not for now, but these ones are going to a craft because of that loss of um, coating. Okay, let's see if we find any of these earrings. Um, here's, the, here's the pair for this earring if you like them. We do have a pair. Okay, let's take a look. I know how I don't have this one. 100% know I don't have this one. Putting it aside. I do have this one. I remember. Okay, here it is. Here it is. So I found the mate for this one. Perfect that we're finding uh, mates for earrings that we found a long time ago. So Monet earrings, gold tone, small half hoops. And let's see if we find any of these. So this one's I definitely... Oh, you know what? I think I have this one also. Give me one second. Okay, guys, we are in luck. So I found, I found a um, pair for this one. These ones are, I do believe, um, silver. I think. I'll test it if you want me to. So yeah, I found, I found the meat for that. Fantastic while i was looking through that pile i thought i didn't have a pair for this clip-on but i do look i found a pair for this clip-on earring this one is a post kind of a end clip post and clip perfect i found a pair for this post earring i need to clean them and put better backings but i found this and let me see Hopefully they're just glass. Yes. Yeah, these ones are glass. Red is glass. Uh, red's glass and clear uh, glass also. Perfect post earrings. I found a made for the triangle earrings. Let's see. No, they're not glass. And I found a made for uh, this um, enamel gold tone and enameled earrings. They're also post earrings. Let's see if they have anything. I don't think they are marked. All right. This was an amazing. This was a Pandora box of uh, jewelry boxes. This was a definitely a Pandora box of jewelry jars. 
I mean, we just scratched the surface and we found gold, silver, silver, gold. I, I, I can't. I can only imagine what's 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 inside. Thank you so much. I appreciate every one of you guys. Thank you for your support. Thank you so for every comment. Thank you so much for every everything. Just the hello uh, means a lot to me. I will see you guys next time. We're gonna finish that baggie. Okay. I can only imagine what we're gonna find. See you later. Bye bye.